Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Destiny Mata. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is December 8th, 2022. Let's take a relaxing brain break. These brain breaks are so helpful. Now let's go learn a new word with word of the day. Hey Jasmine, did you not went to Disneyland this weekend? I did not have a lot of patience waiting on those lines. Yeah, but even though you had to wait in those really long lines, it was worth it to go on those really cool roller coasters. I wish I had the patience that you had on those lines. Thanks. See, see you tomorrow, tomorrow on word of the day. day. Now let's see what happened today in history with Sophia. Thank you, Destiny. Hey, Patriots. In today's history, on December 8, 2010, the American aerospace venture SpaceX became the first commercial company to release a spacecraft until orbit successfully come back to Earth. SpaceX, owned by multi-billionaire Elon Musk, is an American aerospace company that helped the era of commercial spaceflight. This spacecraft is called the Dragon. Did you know that the Space Dragon is the only flying spacecraft that is capable of returning cargo to Earth? It has a total of 37 total launches and can hold up to 7 people. Hmm, I wonder how it feels to travel in a spacecraft. Would you do it? I know I would. Now let's see what's on today's menu with Alexander. Thank you, Sophia. Today's tasty lunch is rotini meat sauce, Italian sandwich, green beans, and mandarin oranges, and a of milk. And tomorrow's amazing breakfast will be cine mini, graham crackers, fresh orange, 100% apple juice, honey and oak granola bar, assorted cereal, and ashes of milk. Students, keep in mind that lunch and breakfast can change at any time and always remember to bring your lunch card. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, now let's go back to destiny. Thank you, Alexander. Super Patriots, this quarter's instructional software challenge is coming to an end soon. All of you still have time to get those lessons done. Just keep putting your mind to it and you're sure to get them done. Take a look at the flyer to see what is required. Patriots, please don't forget our cell phone policies. It is important to make sure you have your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And also, don't forget you are not allowed to chew gum in school, so make sure to spit it out before you enter the building. NWEA winter is ending today, with the K-1st graders taking their NWEA math test. Good luck, K-1st. I believe in you. Patriots, our Epic Sports Fun Day plus Color Run is coming up on the 16th. Make sure to tell your parents to register you so you can participate in the sports stations. And for even more fun, raise $30 and you can participate in the color run. Make sure to do all of this by December 11th and use the description below to register. I can't wait for the color run. The picture store is open every morning till 7.55. Make sure to go on your day before it closes. Tomorrow is the kindergartner's turn to buy some cool items at the picture store. Make sure to bring your tickets. Keep getting in the Christmas spirit by participating in this month's Christmas themed activities. Tomorrow, December 9th, wear your favorite holiday socks. I can't wait to see all your festive socks. The Ugly Sweater Party is coming up, Patriots. It will be on December 16th from 6 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. There will be music, food, games, and prizes. Make sure to pay before Monday, December 12th to come. Now let's see what the weather looks like today with Nia. Thank you, Destiny. Good morning, Patriots. For today's weather, you can expect 83 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly sunny skies. It's a bit cooler today, so make sure you step out and get some fresh air. In other weather news, have you ever seen this bat before? The northern long-eared bat has been added to the endangered species list. 
This is mainly due to something called white nose syndrome, which is a fungal disease. It's called white nose because of the white growth you can see on them when infected. These bats live in almost every U.S. state and most of Canada. President Biden is launching a 2023 protection program to try and help the bats. Let's hope his plan works! Today's birthday boys and girls are Juan Diaz Manrique, Aubrey Campos, Alyssa Jean Pierre, and Yanice Walker. Happy birthday, now let's go back to destiny. Thank you, Hendrik. Patriots, hear your Pat's expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Here are Wednesday's Daily Challenge winners. Congrats to Ms. I'm Dane Kwa, Ms. Arnold, Ms. Pardinez, Ms. Stone, Ms. Sands, Ms. Chang, Ms. Barrow, and Ms. Merkel. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's Daily Challenge, which was, a boy and a doctor are fishing. The boy is the doctor's son. However, the doctor's not the boy's father. Who is the doctor? The correct answer was his mother. Now for today's Daily Challenge. Daily Challenge. How many gifts in total were given in the 12 days of Christmas song? Teachers, Please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answer to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday. And remember, here at Pines, we're going to renew excellence in education. Have a great day!